Just one lasting image of a loving princess who devoted so much of her short life to others. Over the past few days, the Great Ormond Street Children's Hospital and her other favorite charities have been inundated with donations in her memory. The fund launched today will help distribute the money. I think it um, is very welcome. Um, it's very important because um, many members of the public um, here at home and indeed overseas um, want to give something to the causes that the Princess of Wales was associated with. This week, the princess was due to be visiting the Osteopathic Centre for Children, a new association for her, and her first official engagement since returning from holiday. It's an operation desperate for support, run by volunteers. We are revolutionary, and the princess is clearly interested in anything which is new and uh, taking us forward into the millennium. In a few years' time, I think we'll be a very large charity, but clearly this is a, an enormous break on our progress. While she used to be patron of a hundred charities, after her divorce, the princess concentrated on just six. These will all benefit every time someone gives in her name. While the charities the princess was linked to have, as one, welcomed the creation of this fund, not surprisingly tonight, they admit nothing can ever replace the high-profile campaigning she did on their behalf. Steve Scott, News at 10, Kensington Palace.